Este video llega a ustedes gracias a nuestros patrones. Especialmente Belki, Emilia, Joel, Edgar y Niño. Bienvenidos a Mingeo TV con sus anfitrionas favoritas, las hermanas gemelas Sol y, y Luna. Luna. Y hoy es jueves. So jueves, jueves de video. video. Today we're gonna be reacting to a vlog of a famous, super ultra famous international producer. <laughs> okay. And his name is Simon Servida. <laughs> The, the video we're gonna be reacting to is called How I Produce SB19 Mapa Making a Slow Pop Ballad. That's right, as you guys know, we enjoyed Simon Servida's vlog previously about how he produced what. And now we're and gonna figure out how he produced Mapa. Exactly, we love the guy, he's the cutest. <laughs> He's super handsome, super call me, call and me. super talented. And single. <laughs> <laughs> We don't know if Simon is single. But. I think he's married. Anyway, yeah, that's good guys are guy. always this married. This is not a conversation. I yeah, know. this is not a conversation, guys. <laughs> Soon in our channel, we're gonna be reacting to Cuento Juan because you guys have requested many, many times. Yeah, you want us to, to, to learn more and more about the guys because they open even more there because they're talking to their friends that one so if you don't want to miss that subscribe, subscribe to this channel. channel activate the bell so you can get a notification when we upload that video and many others and when we reach 30,000 subscribers we're gonna well, we don't have 30,000 subscribers yet. probably we don't have it we're gonna have a live q a yes. <laughs> we also have a facebook page yes. it's called mini tv game yes. so go ahead and give us a like over there we are streaming video games so if you like this content you will enjoy playing with us also we upload a summary of our videos to our second youtube channel it's called video, video games. games so go ahead and subscribe over there because i know you are interested in this kind of content okay <laughs> so yeah, let's go ahead and see how Simon Servita produced. What's up, welcome back to the channel. My name is Simon Servita and today I'm going to show you how I produce MAPA by SB19. So at the beginning, what Pablo sent me was the demo and a couple of instructions. This is the demo I got at the very beginning. It's pretty much just Pablo playing with the guitar. Mapa means map, but it also short for mama and papa. The song is for giving thanks to parents. They guided us like a map, so we will never get lost. Facts. For the instruments, piano, <laughs> guitar, bass, synth, and it's slowly getting heavier and heavier as we go throughout the song. So what I did was I loaded up a piano and I just played along with the vocals until I figured something out. This or this? This or this? Ah. Mama. Kamusta na di na? Tayo lagi nagkikita Miss na kita sobra Oh wow I really like Justin's vocals for That's for not this Justin's part. No, that's, that's not Justin, that's what I'm saying Oh wow <laughs> <laughs> no I shame. was going to say that I really like how Pablo sings the song too He put too much <laughs> rasp in his voice <laughs> but that's the beauty of his voice i know that's the beauty of his <laughs> voice but i believe that it was a good decision to put justin to open this song mm. i want the lyrics to really stick out in the music so mm -hmm. maybe in the first verse we could just make it like really simple like chord progression and then some counter melodies but not too much so this next section the pre-chorus is easily my favorite part of the song during this part we get these really pretty falsetto vocals the chord progression changes up Finally add in some bass, so now it just starts feeling really, really full all of a sudden. And then on top of that, just some really smooth instruments to go along with it. 
simple verse and then just slowly getting a bit more complex. Oh, woo, chill. chill. <laughs> <laughs> he even got chills when he was producing this. Aww. First we start adding a bit of drums, so just a kick and a clap. Really big open clap so it feels like it's a lot of people. Also added this gospel <laughs> so it feels like it's a lot of people. I'm disappointed. My day is ruined. Also added this gospel part of atmosphere. Same chords, just a lot of notes, so it just sounds super, super big. I didn't notice that in the song. They did remove it. Did they remove it? Like Pablo didn't like it. Or they move it to the last part. Let's see. <laughs> to that version, it was pretty close to what he wanted, so we only had to do little changes. For example, at the beginning of the chorus, we remove the guitar, we add a solo violin instead. <laughs> at the second verse, we start to introduce a beat. This was the first attempt at it. It's too complex. It's supposed to be more simple. This is the rhythm we ended up doing later. It's a bit more fast paced. But using all the same drum sounds as before. This is the old one. Yeah, this, this is Trisher. Or not. I really piano, love the bass, bass there. I know. The bass is doing it. Isn't it late over there? It's uh 2.30 a.m. Oh my gosh, okay. So for the pre-chorus, I'm thinking like, maybe we could change it up a little bit just to intensify the arrangement, like maybe uh just chords, but continuous chords, for, for example, like it's slowly like losing volume. So then, 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 then. During the second few chords, we added some rhythmic. I love Pablo's indications. And I love this editing, like the dun 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 dun. The instruments just to make it feel a bit more intense. Pizzicato strings with a little echo on it. Instead of holding out the piano chords Wait, like this. Why I haven't noticed? All these violins and all this stuff in the song. I don't know. <laughs> what we happened are focusing to my music a lot. isolation? We are focusing a lot on the voice. On the vocals, right? Yeah. Oh, wow. We played them a lot shorter, more broken up. Also, this synth thing comes in. I think it's a future based synth. And that just makes everything really intense. Let's take a look at some of the failed attempts. So Pablo was sending me instructions for a bunch of different songs, and I kind of got them confused. So initially, I thought these were the instructions for MAPA. So Pablo sent me an acapella for his upcoming song. I like the sound suspenseful, scary, EDM vibes, similar to Billie Eilish. Um, the acapella <laughs> itself. Oh um, my god, he's giving us a spoiler for another song that is gonna happen. Really? Remember they are making a full album. Yes. So he thought those were the instructions for MAPA. <laughs> but it was for another song. And he's gonna be thrilling the Eilish style. Oh my god, I can't wait. I'm happy. I'm not sure how I'm gonna do it. How am I gonna make this scary though? It's like a really happy... I gotta reharmonize it a bit. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, because it's gonna 
be the end too, you know? to add more top line to it more lyrics so mm -hmm. i think we should add four more bars to it in the original demo the bridge was this long and then he ended up deciding to extend it like this much i think so during this bridge part i actually wasn't working with any of the vocals but here's what i did you can go crazy on the drums and the arrangement just like how a band would play live you get the acoustic drum kit bring in some snares just slowly Slowly building up the drums. Next half, I think there's a tambourine. What is this for the bass? Piano, bass, electric guitar. I think that's it. And just to help out that acoustic live band feel, I have these little pockets where everybody's doing the same rhythm. Ah, here again. Slow it down again. Just the piano, vocals. Right before the key change, I am reversing a bunch of instruments. Little tom fill right at the end. I love that part. Yes. And that's pretty much everything on my end. I'm really excited to hear the song because I'm sure there's a lot they're going to add. I only heard Pablo's vocals, so they're going to add the rest of the members. No idea what he wrote for the bridge or how the final course is going to sound with the key change. They're probably going to add a lot more vocals and harmonies and stuff. But this is pretty much a breakdown of the instrumental portion. Thank you so much for watching the video. Hope you enjoyed it. I have to give a big thank you to SB19 for the opportunity. I had a lot of fun making this instrumental. Mainly I'm making stuff like hip hop and R&B, so doing a slow ballad was really fun for me. Also, I need a favor from you guys. So currently, SB19 is nominated as a top social artist in the oh, Philippines. Oh, so he's promoting! You guys go to the website and vote for them. Yeah, now it's not relevant because yeah, it's already yeah. passed. So thank you, Simon, for promoting and even teaching people how to vote. Yes, that was very nice of him. <sighs> I loved it. Now I, loved I feel it. complete. Now that I see that, now that I know how it was produced. <laughs> yeah. But it looks like uh, Pablo did not. Complaining a lot, like he did when he <laughs> like produced. When, yeah, like when, when, when he did when he produced what? what? I said mom. <laughs> <laughs> he I was always like, no, it's not like this. No, it's not that. But it looks like. You Simon. know what I found curious that Simon found the la ta ta very happy, like us. Like I found it very happy, la ta 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 ta. -da. Like when you don't speak Tagal. <laughs> Mm -hmm. You could not like relate the sadness that this part has, and yes. you just see like the it's, it's a happy melody. It's a happy melody, guys. Yes. So yeah, like we we have like the same views. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Why I'm getting tired suddenly? Oh wow. Guys, now watch this, this video. video that appears right here because it's recommended by YouTube's algorithm, especially, especially for, for you. you. So click on it right now. <laughs> Oh, God. 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 Oh,